Good afternoon, everyone. Hope you guys are having a great Sunday. So I'm at a Halloween store that just um, recently opened, and its uh, location used to be a Christian store. Who knew, huh? So this is my first time around this area, so I'm going to show you what, I, what these guys have right now. So you got the Pennywise mask, the makeup from the new one. I think it's even the costume as well. Mm -hmm. See, that's that's classic right there. Look at that price, seventy. Damn, that's a lot of money. Then you got your classic slasher uh, uh, perks. I mean, uh, props. See, I want to cosplay as. Uh, as a unique version of uh, Freddy Krueger. I saw this in the meme, and it's uh, Mr. Rogers wearing the uh, sweater of uh, of uh, Freddy Krueger with the claws. Oh, hi. Hi, nerdy boobs. How you doing, sweetheart? All right, hope you're having a great day at work, Pookie Bear. So we got some Riverdale stuff. What we got here? We got the hat with the wig. You got the accessory. You got Josie. You got this outfit. Ooh. See, I think this will look good on you, Kate. This will definitely look good on you. And then you got the, uh, I think it's the Letterman jacket. But you could always get a good one. No. Then you have Diaz de los Muertos. Or day of the dead. Eight feet? What are you talking about eight feet? That ain't eight feet. See, I always had a thing for women wearing uh, sugar skull makeup. That's that's my, my weakness right there. And you got your uh, kind of zombie stuff. Then you got your machetes, your blades. Oh, this is a good one. I would definitely like to wear this during church. <laughs> How much is this anyway? Well, it tells you the size. Does it say the size? Oh, it says right here. I'm sorry. And it's extra large. So it'll fit me. But I'm not sure if it will fit me comfortably. I don't feel, I don't feel it's being, you know, like, constricted. Yeah, this is definitely something I would like to wear. Yeah, we'll see how it goes. I'll wear this one with the uh, Joker makeup. And my baggie. Okay, this is the uh, feeding room. Your cauldrons. Oh, you got your beer juice outfits. Edward Scissorhands. See, I actually have the authentic one from the uh, from that combo of the uh, book. Let me just try to put it on it. See how comfortable it feels. Actually, this does feel a lot more comfortable. 
It really does. It's a good size. I could actually breathe. Yeah, see right here. <laughs> That's my mustache. Yeah, this is actually does feel a bit comfortable. I think the other one's more like Killer Clowns from Outer Space. If you haven't seen it, it's a good movie. It's a good horror movie. A good uh, sci-fi. No, it's more like a '80s punk rock horror movie. And you got the uh, Nightmare Before Christmas. You got some vampire stuff around here. Look at that, you got the finger god. You know, I was I was watching uh, Monster Squad a few days ago and I don't know, I, I really like to I really like the cosplay as Dracula from that version. And then you got the Ghostbusters outfit. So yeah, I'd rather buy this one from like an authentic cosplay shop than here. Unless I'm planning to get it dirty. Then you got your kind of uh, age type of uh, attire. This is, this is cool. This is really cool. Yeah, I probably might take this one. Might. Yeah, I'll definitely gonna check it out. I'm definitely going to put a little, uh, have I checked this side yet? No, I, I don't think so. See, this is this is sexy. You put on the Harley Quinn makeup on. Have your Joker. Oh, that would be badass. Hey, is that V? Oh, that's not V. Step here. Step here. That, that, was, that was a good one. There's a hydraulic behind the spider. And then when you step, okay, you gotta let it restart. Reset, I mean, and then you gotta step. I'm stepping. There you go. See, this would be excellent like for a Resident Evil theme. And then you got your buckets. This thing was rolling, I'm not kidding. See, I'm stepping on it. Mm. See, it, it's it's misbehaving. And this is supposed to be like a nurse. Well, I would say it will look like the nurse from Silent Hills. Okay, you got all your lights, your candles, the black lights. Oh, see, this is this is my shit right here. The gavel, the gavel. Then you got your pipe, but I'm not sure if it's a functioning type. I, I don't think so, but.
See, I need to buy one of those. If I'm planning to do the Arkham Two-Face again. I did a really good job of it, but the thing was that it was... Uh, I, I bought it too small, and it slowly ripped throughout the course of the day. Okay, this is your Marvel stuff. So you got your One Piece. See, Deadpool can cosplay as whatever. No, I don't think you're going to get Stormbreaker in, in here. But it wouldn't surprise me, there is a Stormbreaker here. Okay, this is your steampunk. Let's see, shoulder armor. See, sometimes I do some shopping. I do a little bit of shopping, cosplay shopping here and there because uh, uh, throughout the course of the year. So that way, in case of like, if I have, if I want to cosplay as a certain character, I could just grab stuff from the storage or around in my room and then just put them up together so yeah it's it's convenient it, it, it saves the trouble okay you got my little pony oh, look at that I'm not sure I there's a lady friend of mine that I'm not sure if she's into this stuff but um, she's kind of short so I don't know maybe I might buy that as a gift for her then you got your ninja turtles Got your Disney stuff here. Doctor Who. Oh, I, I have another lady friend that big, 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 big fan of Doctor Who. Oh, see, this is badass. If you put this shit on on any convention, they know exactly who the hell you're cosplaying as or competing. Right now, this is the 1920s and 30s. See, so I get one of those holsters for uh, Leon one day from uh, Resident Evil 2. No, 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 not from Resident Evil 2. I, I think it might be for another character to cosplay. So you got the Maleficent horns. See, I want to cosplay as the Horn King from uh, the Black Cauldron. And I think these would be excellent to put on. I just need to kind of learn how to... Well, I think I could do it. I think I could... Pull it off. And I think you got your little bit of, uh, you know, off track. Well, I think more of like ladies type of apparel of Disney stuff. Like fairy tale. And kind of you got your 60s and 70s. <laughs> El, El Cool J. You know, I haven't seen anyone cosplay as an icon as El, El Cool J. Like, I know, uh, I know a guy who cosplay. His name is Dan. Great guy. He cosplayed as a. Uh, he usually cosplays as Batman. Oh, look at that! You got Wanda Woman. What is that? Oh, is that the Tierra? Then you got that one. Now, is this like one size fits all, or? Because yeah, I don't want to, like, because this is convenient if I want to. Because I'm planning to cosplay as a Superman version.
But I think I probably might have to get some other better gauntlets. See, this is this is cool, but it's you could definitely save a lot of money if you just buy a shirt, buy the Superman shirt, and the suspenders. I, I think it makes it more authentic. I think it would even be much cheaper. Let's see. Have I been? Shira back and cap. Okay, this is more Marvel. Oh, look at it. you got Pit Boy from uh, Fallout. This is the well, it's all made out of kind of foam. So I mean, I I wouldn't wear it. I mean, unless if it's like you know last minute shopping and you forgot, you know, us customers we tend to forget a lot of shit. Then you got your headstones, your chair, your chains. Then you got your joker. See, this is nice. Badass, flip the switch. So I, I, I'm assuming you you replace your switch uh, cover, and then you put this on. So this is this will be badass. Like for my like if I'm planning to do something cool with my room. Like I want to leave it like a kind of like a Dino Lab theme, like Jurassic Park oriented. So this could definitely work, you know, to decorate. But fall is coming, and I'm going to leave my fucking windows open. Yeah, no, 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 no. I just fucking hate being locked. What is this? The Joker cane. That is crazy. And you put them together. See, I, I had a um, Assassin's Creed uh, cane uh, from uh, what was it from the Syndicate, and unfortunately, it broke. And see, that's what happens when you have too many people in one house. Oh, what's this? You got your Harley Quinn uh, wig. I can know. I actually know quite a few people who actually have dyed this and took time. It it looks really cool. Let's see what we got here. Okay, you got the weapons for uh, Deadshot. See, there you go. You got the wig from uh, Harley Quinn. Got the mask from Katana. Um, I have a cosplay colleague of mine. Her name is Priscilla. And uh, her daughter does a good... Does a really good uh, Katana cosplay. Then you got the Incredibles. Got your Naruto, but you get a good one somewhere else. Okay, you got your skeletons, your skulls. The face off bear. Try me. You never play with me anymore. Whoa. 
That's a good one. That's a good one. It uh, reminds me of Silent Hill. See, this is definitely something that you could definitely see in Silent Hill. And what is this? No, I think this one's broken. Then you got penny worth right here. Worth a hundred dollars. But how do you do you just put batteries on it or, or what do you do with it? Then you got your candles. And then this is your pop culture stuff. You got your like your Star Wars. And then you got your Pokemon. And then you got some you got some silly stuff here and there. You got the Ferris Bueller jacket. It was a costume kit. But I don't know, for me, I, I would rather buy the, the, the authentic life, the, the good one. See, this is badass for Resident Evil. And that one too. You got your Dragon Ball, you got your anime cartoon wig. Yeah, but there are some wigs I may have to kind of wear or buy, because there's some that I don't think will fit good on me. Oh, and then you got your onesies. And you got your gaming ones. Then you got your Harry Potter. Now I know someone who's really big into Gryffindor, but I'm not sure because I, I don't want to buy something for her and then like she already has it, so I don't want to kind of, you know, put all that. I mean, she's a good friend, but I 
You know what I mean? Like, I don't want to buy something and say, Oh, hi, thank you, that's so sweet, but I already have this one, so. I don't know, I probably might just ask her if she has a scarf like that. See, this, what is this? Okay, so you put your, you put your head in there, and you just. This is creepy. Okay, now you got your ninja stuff. Ooh, excuse me. Then you got your pirate stuff, you got your movies. No, this is like your military stuff, your career. Yeah. Yeah, this is more of kids section, so. It, it's not gonna fit on me no matter how badly I work on it. Now, I do need to buy some, something like this. I could probably might have to buy that one. Might have to buy that one too. Maybe this one too, if I want to get really graphic and detail on the, uh, Jurassic Park. See, I would wear this one. See, I want to cosplay as a uh, Azrael from uh, Dogma, the uh, demon. What is this supposed to be? Tripopophobia. Yeah, I mean, just the kid stuff. Then you got your little party. Yeah, this is still party stuff. Okay. Alright, then that's pretty much it. So, I took a little quick browse on what I'm plan to buy for the next uh, for my next paycheck I'm trying to kind of calm down on the expenses because uh, yesterday I did went a little overboard but it was worth it so uh, we'll see how it goes for the next check so you guys have a great day and I'll see you guys later